Hey, what's going on everyone? This is me, Mr. Mario. Anyways, I'm going to be bringing you this video on how you could possibly, possibly get past your school's firewall or your place of work. Now, I will bring up the disclaimer again. Please, please do this at your own risk. This is probably against the terms of service at wherever you're going to use it. And neither I nor the creators of this program are responsible for anything negative that happens. I know several people that use this in high school and it worked in there. However, there were also several people that did get caught using this program and had their computer privileges revoked. Knowing that warning, knowing that you are taking this risk, let's go ahead and do this. Now if you use this at home, you're not going to pose any threat. But this is the program. You go to ultrasurf.us. It's a free download. It's less than a megabyte and a half. You just click ultrasurf free download right here. Download this little tiny program called u.zip. Now it shows u1.zip because I already downloaded it. But let's go ahead and cancel out of there and I already extracted it to a folder called U. Now this folder I'd recommend copying to a flash drive or something like that. Don't put it on a network drive that you might have at school. But let's go ahead and open this up. Now occasionally you will have to update this. This is the 1201 build and give it about five or 10 seconds because it does have to find the proxy and find a safe way to get through. Sometimes it may, my, uh, may take longer, but we'll see what happens. Anyways, it opens this up and it opens this up through Internet Explorer. Now I know Internet Explorer isn't the best, but this is probably the best for UltraSurf because it uses kind of its own modified version of it and it's not going to leave a digital footprint or anything like that. Now there is a way you can run it through Firefox. I don't think you can do it on Chrome, but I will show you. You can go to ultrasurf.us slash support.html and you can download this add-on for Firefox. You click here, but down here you can click the add-on and it shows how to install it. It's pretty easy to do. However, you are going to install it on that computer that you're using. That's the only bad thing about this. You can also change the options on here, play with all of this, hide the golden lock, everything like that. But let's go ahead, exit out of this close IE and exit. Anyways, that worked for me in high school. It worked for my friends. It might not work on your firewall. It all depends. But again, I'm going to urge you all, please do this at your own risk. I will not be held responsible for any damage or any consequences, and neither should these creators. This is supposed to circumvent um, censorship and such in places like China and all those other places that do block the internet. This is like a more lightweight version of Tor, if you're familiar with that. So anyways, I hope I helped you all out. This is Mr. Mario, signing off.